Hi, welcome to Tea and Mystics. Today I wanted to share a little glimpse of a new tarot deck I just got in the mail last night while I am sipping on some pumpkin ashwagandha tea. So the new deck that I received is Grail Tarot, um, a Templar vi vi Vision, <laughs> sorry, and it comes with this wonderful book and I uh, actually ordered the deck quite a while ago and I was really excited because it finally came in the mail yesterday. And this is a really lovely deck and it definitely takes its own spin on creating a tarot deck. So this is just a bit of a look at some of the major arcana cards, which while you can see their relation to the more traditional tarot deck and names, it definitely has still its own interpretation upon it. And this Grail, I'm um, sorry, this Grail vision for a tarot deck is really all about tapping into that mystical and that spiritual journey that all of us are on and can be on. I really love how all the major arcana cards um, can be put together to create a medieval-esque frieze. It's very beautiful. I really enjoy the illustrations and I'm very much enjoying reading the book and getting into the um, meaning of the different cards, what's represented on them. This is definitely a deck you want to get familiar with as you are using it. The book also includes some suggestions for some tarot spreads that you can use with the deck. The suits of the minor arcana are stones, swords, lances, and vessels. And each of those cards is also very beautiful. And I've just started to read and get into um, the meaning of the different ones and how they can relate to a reading. So I just wanted to make a quick video to show a glimpse of this new tarot deck. Um, this is what the cards look like on the back. There's this beautiful um, burgundy color with a seal, a Templar's seal on them. Just another sort of glimpse at the cards. So I'm definitely very happy with it so far and I'm going to be learning about it, more about the deck um, in the coming weeks. Today I am sipping on some pu pumpkin ashwagandha tea. It's actually my last little bit of the tea. I'm really enjoying it. It was a perfect tea for October. I've shared some thoughts of the tea in some previous videos if you'd like to check that out. Thanks so much for tuning in to Tea and Mystics. Cheers!